In this video I will show you how to connect your uh, Samsung Galaxy A series phones to your uh, computer, laptop or Mac uh, so you can transfer files, images, movies and stuff like that. Uh, this uh, will work on pretty much all Samsung A series phones including the A24, 34, 54, uh, 15 and uh, so on. So the first things first, we'll need your cable. This is the same cable used to charge your phone basically and plug it in your phone basically and your device. Then uh, make sure you unlock your phone if you got some security on it and open it up basically. And a pop-up like this will appear here. We need to click allow on this one. So make sure you do this. If you don't do this, nothing really will happen basically as this is a basic Android security. If for some reason you don't see this pop-up as sometimes on some of the Samsung phones uh, it doesn't show up for some reason. Then uh, you have to basically set, go to the top of the phone basically and swipe down till you see uh, these notifications here. It will most likely say uh, USB for something, USB for charging maybe if it's not giving you all that prompting period of the screen. Then click again on this one and we need to select this uh, transferring files basically. So make sure you select this if you don't have it already there selected. Then if for some reason uh, this small pop-up doesn't appear and also when you scroll from up to down it doesn't uh, even offer these things. It maybe shows just that it's charging the phone then uh, there is possibility there's something wrong either with the cable or your phone port basically and for the phone port you basically have to clean it as some gunk might have gotten stuck inside there such some pocket linked or something like that what we can do is uh, we can uh, take a fine sewing needle very very small one and you can easily clean any gunk from there. If you actually check out my channel, I have a proper video on how to do it in very good detail. Also, then uh, um, we can take a simple brush like this and take a few strands from it like this and get it inside the hole and basically brush it out properly while you're holding the phone like this, obviously. And this works really, really well, actually. Then also you can use a blower like this that you can blow inside the hole that it really blows out huge force of air so it will blow out any junk. Then if uh, your charger hole looks uh, decent then uh, there might be a problem with your cable basically. Um, especially if this is not the original cable that came with the phone. Sometimes they, they don't really work even for transferring files if it's not the original one or if it's worn down or something has happened to it. So you can try another cable basically. Even if your phone charges with this same cable and it appears okay uh, visually, it doesn't automatically mean that it will work for file transfer. So that's one thing. Then once we have the cable ready and everything is connected, then it's fairly easy. On the Windows, uh, you have to go basically to your start and go to uh, this PC, or it might say just PC. Anyway, it might be a bit different depending on your Windows version. So we click on that and click on the device name that you have. Then click on internal storage. And then, for example, if you want to transfer out uh, the images, uh, they are located in this folder, DCIM. Click on that, and again, and wait till all these images finish loading. If you have a lot of images on your phone, it might take a few minutes. So, And it's important that you actually wait till all these images um, basically finish showing up and this, uh, they are discovered. If you try to touch them uh, while it's showing this green bar here, it will show a green bar, a progress bar basically. If you try to touch them uh, during that, the whole process will basically crash. So just wait till all loads. Then if you want to transfer your image, simply select the ones you need, click copy as usual, then maybe make a new folder on your desktop and click 
paste and your image will be transferred here. So, okay, and then what uh, What if we want to maybe transfer something to your phone, such as maybe we want to watch some movie or listen to music on your phone. So we actually go back to the main, main storage basically and click again till you see all of these folders. Then you already got a folder for mu movies here and music. Uh, if you want to transfer movie, for example, go to your movie file and you can simply click uh, the copy paste or you can simply drag drag it there and the movie will basically be transferred to your phone very very shortly so this is how you do the file transfer process on basically all of the uh, galaxy's a series phones if this is helpful make sure to hit the like button see you